this is Preeti from Analytics India magazine. Welcome back to another episode from Data Science as a Career. And today we will be talking about how to become a self-taught data scientist and the right way to go about with it. In order to understand things better, let's look at the hiring trends in data science. While IT services company CSS Scott places importance on a formal academic background, LinkedIn admittedly hires candidates based on skill sets alone and not necessarily on their educational backgrounds. However, it is not to say that self-taught data scientists do not have a difficult journey ahead of them. Let's go ahead and look at some ways to help you in your journey of becoming a successful self-taught data scientist. Coming to the first step, upskill through relevant certificates. A university degree is a great accomplishment. While it can lay down the foundation for your career in data science, it is not a key qualifying factor when applying for tech positions. Even though you may be competing against applicants who have relevant degrees, you can garner a competitive advantage with upskilling using the world of resources available online. What is more, self-study also signals a candidate's motivation to succeed. But you need to first narrow down what you need to learn to substitute for your lack in formal training. Data science is a broad discipline and comprises a wide collection of jobs. From statisticians to machine learning experts to business analysts to data visualization experts. Since the skills required for each vary, it is important to first narrow down the skill sets you need to acquire and then create a plan around it. Coming to the next step, apply your data science skills. The next step would be to apply your skills in projects that not only give you the opportunity to practice, but also gives potential employers an idea of the breadth of your knowledge on the practical use of these skills. Create a data science portfolio on Kaggle and GitHub. In fact, there is an emerging trend where tech companies directly scrutinize these online portals to find the right talent. Such platforms gives you an opportunity to build a portfolio of your work to stand out among other candidates. Startups typically employ such non-traditional ways of hiring candidates. And it is often in these companies that a lack of degree is likely to matter less. Even big tech companies have begun to explore these avenues. Coming to the next step, establishing a work experience. While acquiring the right skills and applying them to manufactured situations through online projects has become a prerequisite, actual corporate experience will hold you in good stead, especially in a room full of applicants who do not come with the same experience. And this is where internships play a role. You can begin by collating practical examples of how you provided business value to companies through short-term freelance gigs. Coming to the last point, taking help from mentors. Data science is a vast universe and it is not an easy discipline to learn. And that's why it may be advisable to take a little help with your studies as well as your career. Mentors or anyone with experience can add a lot of value to your self-study process. They can help identify the blind spots in the beginning itself and guide you to a path to a more effective learning experience. I'll provide a link to our own mentorship program below. With that, we come to the end of this video. Don't forget to subscribe to Analytics India magazine and follow this segment for everything in the world related to data science as a career. See you soon. Bye.